Hello, Alyssa Weinsamer, vocal health educator and founder of Voice Body Connection here. I am so excited to be sharing an impulse exercise with you today as part of my How to Warm Up video series. And this is my very favorite impulse exercise of all. And part of the reason I love it so much is because it's so simple and you can do it anytime, anywhere. So I'm gonna demonstrate it for you a little bit and also talk you through it because this one mostly has a structure, okay? So what you're gonna do is when you're warming up, and by the way, not only is this a great impulse exercise, but it's my favorite way to warm up when you're like, I don't know what to do today, right? Here's why. You're gonna ask yourself, how am I feeling right now? And then you're gonna say, what would feel good? And you're gonna do what feels good, okay? So what you wanna do is some sort of repetitive motion that you can do over and over. Like let's say I decide that I don't feel like I'm connected to my hips, so I'm gonna start doing a repetitive motion where I just move my hips side to side. And obviously you could do this in your own private space or if you're in a more public space, you can do socially acceptable things that would feel good, right? So I'm gonna start moving my hips because that feels good. And then after about 30 seconds, a minute, you're gonna say, yeah, that feels good, but what would feel even better? And I'm having the impulse right now that my arm wanted to move. So maybe I start to do sort of arm circles. And do you see how I'm choosing things that are things that I can repeat over and over so my body can just start to really feel its way into this motion, right? And then maybe, of course, I would be like, mm, the next thing that would feel good is to switch to the other side, right? So every 30 seconds to a minute, you're gonna say, yeah, this feels good, but what would feel even better? And then you'll do that, right? And maybe this is my little motion right here, is just wiggling back and forth. It can be big, it can be small. So I'm actually totally feeling the impulse to just go ahead and dive into this whole thing right now. Um, but basically, long story short, if you spend about 30 seconds to a minute in each choice that you make, committing to that choice, doing it fully, whether it's circling your foot or moving your wrists around, right? You commit to that choice, and then 30 seconds to a minute later, you go, that felt good, but what would feel even better? I call this the do what feels good exercise, okay? So that's a great way to warm up your impulses, get yourself connected to what you want to do, um, which then, this is a, more of a physical exercise, but of course, actually I should definitely say this before the video ends, that you can make sound too, right? So you can do what would feel good and you can start going, ah, ha, 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 right? I just wanna mostly be goofy on this video. So does that make sense? Do what feels good. Do it with your voice, do it with your body, do what feels good. Spend about five minutes doing this, guarantee you'll feel better than when you started. That is the impulse exercise, do what feels good.